The central thesis of the rational emotive therapy is that irrational beliefs mediate between the antecedent events and their consequences. When you reached here with your previous documents, your medical history indicated that you have had symptoms of anxiety in the past. Yes, and now that I have started going to college, I am experiencing some changes emotionally. Okay. How has college been emotionally to you? Bit scary to be very honest. Okay. What scares you? Meeting new people, the fear that I will face rejection and they may not like me. Though it has not happened yet, but I just feel this way. Okay, I understand. As you mentioned, you feel a little apprehensive about going to college. Am I correct? Yes, exactly. Okay, I'll tell you very honestly. It all started when I was in school. I had nobody to talk to. All of my supposed friends used to make fun of my appearance, the way I was. Imagine the people you trust uh, take up your insecurities and put it on a display for everyone to see. Okay, I see you went through all that. How did that affect you? It just made me want to, uh, made me feel that I want to be someone else, just not me. That I should change my appearance. I should be someone else to be loved and to be appreciated. I, uh, I felt that I must comply to all of their demands. Since you have gone through all this, have you experienced any changes in your social dynamics? I don't like going out. I have isolated myself and I just prefer to stay alone. In non-directive questioning, the therapist takes a non-judgmental stance and uses active listening to bring out the client's attitudes and feelings. In this sense, the therapist strives to allow clients themselves to set the terms and parameters of the discussion. Okay, tell me, what thoughts come to mind when I say you have to go to college and meet new people? I feel very nervous because there are so many things that I have been told that are not good about me that thinking about going to college it just makes it worse. Let's do one thing. Tell me the things you like about your personality. Like about my personality? Yes, like about your personality. I haven't thought about this, but if I think my kindness maybe, if that even counts, it counts. My presence of mind maybe. Now, whenever you feel nervous, keep in mind the positive perspectives we have discussed. Yes, surely you have been a great help. I wish you well in all your future endeavors and remember, my door is always open for you.